situation. How? You say, Kanga, you have something that doesn't belong to you. That's not your piglet. That's our piglet. And then, then what? But we'll schlock let piglet go. Or at least she ought to. There's a difference between have to and ought to. And Kangas are generally regarded as one of the fiercer animals. I want true. I wouldn't want to do anything foolish. You've already done something foolish. And I just happen to remember... What? Bears are also regarded as one of the fiercer animals. Bears? Very fierce. Me? They snarl and growl and do all sorts of nasty things. Can't you growl too? I don't know. Try. Grr. How was that? It wasn't much. Grr. Have some more snarl, grrr. Better, don't you think? A growl ought to be blood curdling. Grrr. Grrr. What was the matter? I frightened myself. I Would you mind? You're blocking the path. Um, After all, it doesn't belong to you, does it? That's what I want to explain. You have something that doesn't belong to you. Whatever is he talking about? Piglet. Who? You are a piglet, aren't you? Of course I am. I just wanted to be sure. You don't look like piglet. Now, now, mustn't let go of my hand. But you ought to let him go. Is it your piglet? Our piglet. Well, no wonder he was in such a state. Your piglet. So if you'd kindly give him back? I'll do no such thing. What an idea. The poor thing is having proper care for the first time in his life. Now move aside. Grr. Out of the way. Grr. What was that? Grr. Oh dear. Oh dear. Grr. <coughs> Stay away from us. Don't you come near us. Grrr! Mm. Frightening, isn't it? <laughs> dreadful. Simply <laughs> dreadful. Grrr! I've never heard anything like it. And I'll keep it up until you let Piglet go. You'll keep it up until you do something about it. That is the worst cold I've ever seen. Cold? Down in your chest, too. Take my advice. Go straight to bed. I did not have a cold. Oh, so I suppose you make breath and like that just for fun or to frighten us. If you have any sins at all, which you probably haven't, you'll take some of this cough medicine, one spoonful every half hour. No, thank you. Drink it all. It tastes like poison. Foolish fair. But we can't help those who won't help themselves. Come on, Piglet. We'll finish our walk in the back and a little nap. Wait, wait a minute. Chin up, Piglet. One, two, one, two, one, two. Owl, Eeyore. What happened? Was she frightened? I don't feel very well. That's gone to my chest. Apparently, Kangle walked off with Piglet while you just stood there. Well, perhaps it's all for the best, and there's no use struggling. Why can't we all go after her if we all surround her? I don't think much of that idea. But you should have seen Piglet. He's turned a different color. There's a bow tied around his neck. It can't go on. Piglet's miserable. I'm miserable, and it goes on and on. If we're going to take action, action all of us together. I'd love to, old fella, but I've got a previous engagement. So have I. Why not ask Rabbit? Rabbit? She said a good deal about taking action. Where will I find her? Uh, she's probably at home. Try knocking. It's a good idea. Rabbit does this. Anyway, she says she does things. <coughs> Rabbit? Is anybody home? What I said, was anybody home? No. Isn't there anybody at all? Nobody. There must be somebody there. Because somebody said no. Hello? Could you kindly tell me where Rabbit is? She's gone, see her. 
friend, Pooh Bear. Oh! But this is me, Pooh. Well, well then, do the man. It is you, I'm glad. Who did you think it was? Well, you know, you can't be too careful lately. You can't have just anybody coming in. Piglet's got to be rescued from Kanga. I can't seem to do it alone. So if you'll come with me right now, you do like to take action, don't you? Certainly. Owl and Ear won't do anything. They're afraid of her. Ha ha. Not like you. Not at all. So let's go. Uh, Pooh, we don't waste time. Wait. I nearly forgot. What? Lunch. No time for that. Imagine my forgetting to eat lunch. Won't you join me? No, no. Fancy, I didn't know I had all this honey. But Piglet, nearly a full pot, wouldn't you say? Honey? Quite full, I'd say. Honey, help yourself, or would you prefer some marmalade? Both. <laughs> Here we are. I really shouldn't. Take the time. Much rescue, Piglet. One does better at rescuing after a bite to eat. Much better. One needs strength. I do feel stronger. And now, have some more. There's an anymore. I have another someplace. Oh, no, no, thank you. Just a nibble? I really couldn't.
crazy about this. Let me go. I'm trying to get you in somehow. You wretched bear out, you no. out. Not, not both. You're just doing this to be stubborn. Ow, no, ow. My room in that dreadful place, and you won't let it out. Nasty, stubborn thing. And take that.
so afraid that I'd forget, but I didn't. Forget what? Forget your birthday. Oh. What's everyone so gloomy about? If there's one thing I can't stand, it's a gloomy attitude. I'm sorry, Eeyore. Now my entire day is ruined. <laughs> so it goes. My birthday? It's a You can't have parties. And not without Pippa. He was so fun at parties. With refreshments, songs, and games. Here we go around the mulberry bush. The one who tries to wait.
car. Aren't I supposed to come with you? I'd like to take care of you and all the rest of them. But I have Rue to think of. I can't do everything. There you go.